you can call him again. This time he'll only look at you. He's getting a little pissed off at us. This is my favorite animation he does watch. Like, err. Fortunately, that glass is really thick. The warp can't hurt us. But that's just um, a warning as to this creature's power. It is not a creature you mess with. They're smart creatures. They know again when they see him. And we just happen to not be again. So now that that's done, we're going to go back to the uh, elevator room. And we're going to take it back up. We're going to skip this animation because it takes forever. Lower the drawbridge! Have fun storming the castle! You crazy kids. Yeah. I freaking love the Princess Bride. Anybody who doesn't should be, you know poison with iocane powder because the princess bride is just awesome. So I turn the other way. Under no circumstances click that uh lever because it takes you the wrong way. Man, if this is Gen's security measure, that's kinda lame. That rotating thing. It's relying on people to be stupid and not uh Yeah. Those pipes by the way in game, they're made of a certain like material that is meant to stretch as the islands pull apart. Yes, the islands are fully pulling themselves apart further and further because of the rift in the crust of this planet. Um, that is why the game and the island is called Ribbon. This lake. Oh, another shot they extensively published. This shot. A little bit further back. This shot. You can see all these tusks around the island from, no doubt, from various warps. Poor warps. You can hear the oboe, which is the instrument that uh, symbolizes Gen in this game. Go back further. You'll see you're walking along some sort of crack. Which you'll see later. This, uh, oh, this button is hard to miss. This crack. Now, Gen is such a crazy nutter that he made a whole representation of all of Ribbon like this. That bit there, that in the middle, that would be uh, the rift in the center tearing Ribbon apart. Those are all the different islands. There's Jungle Island, I think that's Temple Island, Book Island, I know Gen's Island, and uh, Boiler Island, I think. I'm not positive. And that's Prison Island. If you toy around with these, it'll raise like bubbles of water. So I'm going to show you. And it shows you the location of the fire marble domes on each island. And there's the big dome. There's the fire marble dome. Um, the fire marble dome for Temple Island is actually kind of hidden. There's the dome. And again, it works with heat. An animation of one of those rising. Kind of nifty, actually. Yep, this works all on topography, as you could probably guess. Now, if we uh, raise the topography of uh, Temple Island here, and then go back. Oh, by the way, there is Denis writing on that. If you look up, well, from a certain spot, you can see a knife there. And depending where the square is, it will show you what is on that square. This is the topography thing. Yep, this is Temple Island, alright. There's one half of the dome. That's the other half of the dome. Gen's got some pretty damn advanced technology here, and there's our dome, actually, right there. Now, that's pretty.
pretty interesting. I'm going to show you a more manageable one, actually. I'm going to show you Prison Island. Um, let me just get turned around here. This is personally a really difficult puzzle um, if you've never played with them before. This is all of Topography Island. You can switch it around and like, turn it. And there is a uh, the dome that leads up to Prison Island. This used to be a giant tree, Prison Island. But it got separated from, I believe, Jungle Island. And now it's not a big tree anymore because it's going to cut it up. Now I'm going to show you what, uh, remember those lights? Those poles were those lights. And uh, this one, this little thing got bent from a warp uh, messing with it. And we, we, we're going to have problems opening the dome because uh, it's bent, so you kind of have to guess it. Oh, there we go. Yep, what those things are for is for matching up the correct color of the dome. I believe this is the violet dome. Now, of course, this doesn't help us because we don't have A, power to it, or B, um, the access codes, numbers. Oh, this is part of the giant knife. The great knife. No, Pyramid Head is not in this game. It's a totally wrong franchise, you silly person. So, what we're going to want to do is get off of this island and start going around and opening all the domes. Actually, we need to go to Temple Island again because we have to solve a puzzle there to give power to the domes. So, until next time, guys, I will see you back on Temple Island. We're going to do a dome run next to open up all the domes, and then we are going to go back to Temple Island and uh, see what we can see there. So until next time, this is the Phantom Safety Pin, and next time, Fire Marble Dome Run. I'll see you later, guys.